Hey guys, how's it going? I want to share some things with you about the website. Uh, so not that long ago, I tried to get on the website acceptandbeconverted.com and it was showing an error, pretty much like this. Now this is a part of the website. Uh, I, I purchased the URL a while back called kjbprayer.com and so if you go there, this is what it takes you to this page. It's not up anymore. And so basically the whole website was down except for the forum. And so I was wondering what in the world is going on. So I had to talk to HostGator, uh, who I do my website through. And um, I talked to them and they couldn't figure things out. Well, I was using a an app or whatever that they provided called Weebly that had a website editor. And so it, had, it came with a free uh, edit, Weebly editor, but it was very limited. And then I paid like 10 bucks a month for like the pro version. And, uh, you know, it allowed all the features and everything. So that's what I used. It made building the website really easy. I spent years on it. I mean, like the past three years, basically, I've been working on the website, learning the codes and trying to get the menu the way that I wanted it to. And it really wasn't that great still. I mean, for me personally, you know, I liked, I liked how it was because it was easy for me to use it. But for somebody new to the website, it's probably hard to understand everything. So it could be a lot more user friendly, basically. Anyways, HostGator made some changes and the whole layout changed and everything. And I guess that they no longer offer Weebly as a service. So that was disappointing. So basically, you know, I have all the pages and everything backed up, but I'm just not able to use things the way that they were. So I basically have to start over. What I found out was that HostGator has made their own website editor. So now I have to use their editor. And actually, their editor seems a lot better. So it's kind of like a blessing in disguise. When I first found out that the website was down, you know, I thought it was a pain and it was depressing a little bit again because, you know, I felt like I lost a lot of my work, even though I had the website backed up. But still, for some reason, it wasn't working. But so basically, here's acceptabeconverted.com now. And I've just been using the free HostGator editor just to test it out. And then when I get paid, in a few days, I'm going to upgrade to the Pro. And uh, so this is probably not how it's going to stay because I'm, I'm going to have a lot more templates available and a lot more available. But I really do like the features. I think that it's going to be a lot better than Weebly. And so this is just an example of what I can do already without even the Pro version. And uh, it's going to be a lot more simplified and user friendly. And, um, you know, I didn't lose the KJV forum, the uh, the board that I had, so that's where I was. That was pretty much what I was making the main site, anyways. So that's where I put all my studies. So that's all still there, thankfully. And uh, you know, I might do some editing on there too. But anyways, um, this is going to be a lot more simplified. And these links are active. Not all of these are active, but I'm not going to put a whole lot more work into it until I upgrade, because I'm probably going to be changing everything, anyways. But I think it looks a lot better. It's going to look better. And it looks better on the mobile version too. So I still have to mess around with things and figure some things out. But now I, I've set up kjbchat.com. So if you go to kjbchat.com, it automatically goes straight to the chat. And I usually use it had some other features and I might make that change again. But for now, it just goes right to the chat on the mobile and on desktop. It doesn't matter. If you go to kjbchat.com, you just go automatically straight to the full page is the chat room. kjbforum.com is still active. Uh, you know, I've got my email. I've got the doctrinal statement, which is a part of the KJV forum there. Okay, for some reason, this goes to the Twitter, so I have to... That, that forum link isn't right, but if you go to kjbforum.com, it'll go there. Um, I got the KJV audio Bible section here. Oops, for some reason it backed me out. Well, here's the website builder. I guess I still had it open. So here's a peek at that. I didn't mean to do this, but I guess this is still up. But here's the website builder now. And uh, so I've got the different elements. And you know, this is just the basic version, but here's the buttons and, and all these different things. And it's basically drag and drop. And so it's it's really easy to, to customize these things. You know, I could I can change that forum link right now. So I would go to I'm gonna make it to where if you click on this icon, it would take you there. So here's the link. 
and I go to the URL, kjforum.com. Looks like it was already set as that, but for some reason, maybe, is there a link here? No. I wonder why I did that. But then I'd go to publish, and that's what makes the website, you know, it puts all those updates on there. But it's going to be going through some changes. It's going to be better. So I'll probably, you know, make another video in a week or so after I mess around with it a bit and kind of got an idea of what I want to stick with for now. But, uh, you know, like I said, I think it's a blessing in disguise. At first I was disappointed. But, um, you know, since I still have all the pages backed up and I still have the KJV forum active and, you know, the chat and everything is still good. And so there's just some, some basic things here that need to be worked on. You know, I might start working on the blog here. Um, where I put, upload like the studies to that. Um, we've got a lot of other plans that I've been wanting to do on the website. And then plus I had that Boxley 350FX or whatever where I did the parody of Ryan Denlinger and stuff. And I, I made that URL, you know, that was gone. So I have to redo that again. But I'm going to redo that. It's going to be something I'm going to continue doing. But you know, I've just got all this different work to, to go on. But this is really easy and um, good, and I think that I'll be able to, to get some things sorted pretty quickly. So it's kind of exciting, really. So I just thought I would share that, and um, I'm going to leave some links in the about me or in the uh, description of some Amazon wish lists that I have and my PayPal if anybody wants to donate anything. Uh, I picked up more hours and stuff, so. I'm going to be a lot better in the coming months, but I'm just going to put it out there if anybody's interested in helping out with any of that stuff. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll get more videos out shortly. God bless.